welcome. This is Today in the News. The highlights. Federal government appeals to striking resident doctors to return to work. Soldiers intercept 132 bags of Indian hemp in Ondo. Gunmen kidnap father of Zamfara Assembly Speaker, seven others. One killed, five injured in Brodun Church demolition. The federal government says negotiations are still ongoing to attend to the demands of the striking doctors, including the request of the payment of hazard allowances, which remains one of the major issues of contention between the government and the striking doctors. Minister of Health Osage Ihanire, during his appeal to resident doctors, noted that the continuous strike is putting the lives of Nigerians at risk and abusing the striking doctors to go back to work. This strike makes it the third time this year that resident doctors have embarked on a strike. Soldiers of the 32 Artillery Brigade have intercepted 132 bags of Indian hemp worth 5.8 million naira. The bags were intercepted separately at Omotosha military checkpoint along Binyore Highway and Owo in Owo local government area. At the Omotosha military checkpoint, 82 bags of Indian hemp being conveyed by drug lords were abandoned in two SUVs, an ash-colored Toyota Sequoia. The drug lords were said to have fled into a nearby bush and abandoned their wares. At least one person was shot dead and five others sustained various degrees of injuries as Bronu Geographic Information Service demolished a church at Modunganari area of Bronu State. Staff of the agency were said to have stomped the community at about 11 o'clock in the morning with a grading truck bringing down the worship center without notifying owners of the church. While residents of the community tried to get reasons for the action, the civilian joint task force attached to the agency allegedly shot in the air to dispatch them, resorting to the killing of one person with five others sustaining various degree of injury. TVC News captured the cops of the person alleged to have been shot by the CJTF and those injured at the Bornu State Specialist Hospital. Eight persons were abducted by unknown gunmen suspected to be bandits in Magaya village in Zumi local government area of Zamfara. Among them is the father of the Speaker of Zamfara State House of Assembly, Nasiru Muzu Magaya. They were abducted on Wednesday night when the heavily armed men invaded the community. Spokesperson of the Zamfara State Police Command, Sheil Mohammed, confirmed the incident to TVC News. He says the command has deployed additional troops to the affected area to ensure the safe return of the victims.